Nicole, and you are watching this week's edition of SPS News. At St. Paul's, we are passionate about making disciples, transforming communities, and planting churches. This Sunday, Rod will be carrying on our vision sermon series. At Children's Church, the under fours will be learning that God is always with us, and the four to ten year olds will be learning about Moses. Our SPS youth will be looking at reading the Bible. Coming up in October, we have Alpha. Alpha is held over seven weeks and is a place where questions of the Christian faith are asked and discussed. Questions like, who is Jesus? How can I have faith? And how do I read the Bible? Each evening session includes a meal, talk, and discussion. Evening Alpha will be held at Departure Cafe in Limehouse and starts on the 15th of October. And Morning Alpha will be held at the Church Institute and starts 17th October. So think of someone you can invite and get them along. Come on, let freedom reign. Yeah, let it be. Here are some dates for your diary. Live Smart Day starts on Saturday the 5th of October, so get booked on today. Let it be known, the love has come. On Sunday the 13th of October, we are joining in with Food Bank Sunday by celebrating God's provision by having a bring and share lunch in the church. So do stay around at the end of the 11 a.m. service on the 13th. Also, have a rummage around your kitchen or add a few items to your shopping list of canned goods or dried food that you can bring along and donate to Food Bank. We shout your name. This winter with six other churches in Tower Hamlets, St Paul's Shadwell are going to be hosting one night of a night shelter. On Sunday evenings, 15 homeless guests will be coming into the crypt underneath church and will receive dinner, stay overnight and get breakfast the following morning. During the week, two workers will be working with them to get them into permanent accommodation. We're looking for volunteers to spend time with the guests, to cook dinner on Sunday evenings and to stay overnight. We also need people to bring dessert to church on Sundays and people who might be interested in running one-off activities with the guests such as music or art. If you're interested in volunteering, please contact Sarah Opie at the email address on screen or contact the church office to get in touch. And why not think about inviting a friend or a colleague along to volunteer with you? Volunteers in previous years have really enjoyed the experience of volunteering and no previous experience is necessary. We have an exciting job opportunity here at SPS. The job title is Team Central Coordinator. This is a job for someone who is passionate about the vision of SBS, who has great people skills and can organise events, finance and people. So if you're interested in this exciting new leadership role, then contact Darren Wolfe. First Friday Film Night is back on this Friday the 4th of October. This time we will be watching Now You See Me. It's a 12 A rated film, so parents use discretion when bringing children along. But we'll see you Friday. Stay in the stay in the light. Oh, 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 hi. <laughs> ah, I hope you all are ready for this weekend. We have our Saturday Night Fever Night here at SPS, where we're going to learn some 70s dance moves, have some buffet food, and enjoy a wonderful, fun filled photo booth. So come along, join in the fun, invite your friends. Starts at 7 30 p.m. here at SPS, Saturday, the 5th of October. We'll see you there and dig out those bell bottoms and dancing shoes. If you are visiting here for the first time, you are so very welcome. We would love for you to experience all aspects of SBS. So do come back next week and the weeks after and complete the More Than Four Challenge. Give us a try for at least four weeks and get a real feel for what being a part of the SPS family is like. In the meantime, if you are new, please do fill out a Connect card which can be found at the back of the church and pop it in the red Connect box near the door. Well, that's it for this week's edition of SPS News. For any more information on what you've seen today, do go to our website at stpaulshadwell.org. Have a wonderful week. Love.